Welcome back to Andy's Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to fix Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone Shaders preloading stock at 0%. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, click on the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. After that, click on the purchase MW3. And you just have to select what kind of edition that you wanted. And you're all set. Now, if you are experiencing an issue where the shaders preloading process in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 or Warzone is stuck at 0%, here are some several potential fixes that you can try. Alright, so number one is... Okay, so you might want to restart the game and launcher, close the game and exit your game launcher at battle.net and restart the launcher and relaunch the game to see if that works and uh, fixes the shaders preloading progresses, alright? Now the next option that you might need to do is, now you might want to check for game updates, ensure that the game is fully updated, go to your battle.net and check for any available updates. If there is, install any pending updates and then try launching the game again. Now, the next option is you might want to repay your game files. Now, for Steam users, open Steam and go to your library right here. And then right-click on Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 or Warzone and select Properties, alright? Now, go to the Local Files tab and click on Verify Integrity of Game Files. Now, try to relaunch the game to see if that works. Now, the next option is you need to update and ensure that your graphics drivers are up to date. Go to the website of a graphics card manufacturer such as AMD or Intel and download the latest drivers. Now, in my case, I'm using NVIDIA, so I went here at the GeForce Experience. And as you can see, I just wanted, I can just install the updated drivers here. There's a download option here. But if you don't have, just click for check for updates. And after installing the updated drivers, restart your computer before launching the game again to see if that works. Now, the next option is you might want to clear some shaders cache. Sometimes clearing the shaders cache can resolve this issue. Now, for Battle.net, typically it's located at C Program Files and Call of Duty Modern Warfare. All right. And try to restart again your computer. Look for a folder named shaders cache or similar and delete it. And after doing so, restart the game and which will force it to rebuild the shader's cache. Okay? Now, the next option that you can do is you might want to try to adjust in-game settings. Lower the graphic settings in the game to see if, if it helps the shaders to load. Go to the game settings, reduce the gra graphics quality and apply changes. Now, this is going to be the last resort because if none of the above works, you might want to try to reinstall the game because uninstalling the game from your launcher, delete any remaining game files in the installation directory, and then try to reinstall the game because it happened into me in the past. What I did was some files were corrupted during the updates. So what I did was reinstall the game and it worked. Now, by trying all of these methods, you should be able to resolve the issue with the shaders preloading being stuck at 0% in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 or Warzone. And again, if the problem persists, consider reaching out to the game's support team for further assistance. They may give you some troubleshooting steps that you can do to fix this problem. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next video.